Hello everybody, and welcome back to Analog Vernacular. Today we're going to be playing some more Wasteland 3. Angela Death told us her plan, we're going to help her with it. bystanders is a hero's number one priority. And that Time means... Time to take some chances and expand man's horizons. That means that we are going to take out Liberty and Papa Buchanan, so... That's the plan. Uh, Lucia said that she would not help us if we came to blows with the Patriarch. So I went to base and I switched her ass out because she is a traitor and she is dead to us. And don't you all forget it. Everything I did for that girl, how dare she. I'm not going to lie, it kind of hurt my feelings a little bit. <laughs> but hey, Scotchmo, this is your chance to shine, my friend. <laughs> figure out where we want to go first. So, where? Yuma County. What's in Yuma? Oh, that's where she's at. Okay. For some reason, I thought she was on the other side of the map. I thought she was over here. So, I feel like we need to finish exploring the map. So... Uh, before we go down into this area, I think we're going to... Let's go up here first, explore this area, and then we'll come around this way. Once we've done that, we go to Yuma. We're getting close to the end, ladies and gents. We're getting close. Um, we won't be able to get away with uh, running away with survivalists as much anymore. Because we don't have a good survivalist anymore. <laughs> I think we have three survivalists. Fact. Um, let's see. Quan, I think we made you the survivalist. Crit resistance? Yeah, let's go ahead and find... Let's give you that. At least then we're at, what, four? <laughs> yeah, okay. That's only going to get us out of some fights. So we're going to have to do more fights this time for sure. No doubt in my mind while we're just moving here. See? Already. Alright, let's sneak up on him. So we'll probably be doing quite a few of these fights. Not too big of a deal, honestly. I just don't like them because these are where you get that one song that always gets claimed on YouTube for some stupid reason. So we are going to turn the music off with the fight. I wonder why the loading screen flashes like that. Flashes to my desktop. I have to imagine that the Dorsey guy that we're also looking for has got to just be like on the map somewhere. We still have that mission and we don't know where he is. Get them all. Okay. Oh, brilliant. <gasps> do we get another shot? We do. We get another shot. That's the first time that ability is actually triggered the way it's supposed to.
Okay, Scotch mode. Um, how's that cone looking? Can we get both of them right now? We can. Oh, so good. It's so good. That shotgun is amazing, and I love it. Four kills in one go. Fucking love it. So it is important to note that he takes a lot of damage as he like breaks through those things. So I do need to be a little bit careful, but also I can repair him afterwards. Um, where are the repair kits? Right there. gonna be your turn. Can't really accomplish anything else. Or can you? Yeah, not really. You can take another shot. Um. Damn. So all you can do is hit this guy, huh? But with this, still 30%, huh? Yeah, I guess it doesn't work like the other sniper rifle does, huh? Okay, well, we're not going to use our precision strike since it's a 30%. But we may as well go for it. And she nails it anyway because she's a Get two shots. Oh, so close. All right, Kyle, finish it though. You have three AP. You can overwatch. Out of ammo? No, oh, weird. How did that happen? I guess because I just, uh... Eh, it doesn't matter. And he just crits it. Oh, there's a guy here. I didn't even realize that. I love you, but you're all dead. <laughs> That's amazing. What were those guns? Nothing new, right? Yeah, those are some some old sniper rifles. 
Nothing I need. Okay, do we have a chest? Right there, let's get it. Get out of here, save, continue exploring. This will probably be an episode completely dedicated to side missions and map exploration, so fair warning. It's kind of what I'm focused on right now. We just uh, want to clear as much as we can because it sounds like as soon as we kill Liberty, um, Angela's people are already going to be like starting a fight with Buchanan. And that means... We're going back to Colorado Springs for a fight. So I kind of want to get as much as done as possible right now on this map. Okay, let's F5 this. Um, yeah, we're going to go top right before going those left rounds. Oh, look at that. A small concrete hatch protrudes from the ground. Beside it, what used to be a mounted turret has been scavenged for parts. Crack open the hatch. A rush of pressure whistles past you as the bunker's warm, putrid air escapes into the cold night. Entering the bunker, you quickly find the source of the smell. The decomposed bodies of the original inhabitants lay in their beds. We'll give them a proper burial. You dig some shallow graves, wrap the corpses in their bed sheets, and bury them. The stench is unbearable, but disperses once they're under earth and snow. You say a few words and head back down. The food is long expired, but you find a fair amount of random supplies. You grab it and go. All food stuff? Ooh. Oh, hey. So, that one was automatic weapons. That's the second one of those we found. Quan needed one as well. You're maxed out on those, right? Yeah, you maxed out automatic weapons. Before we use yours, we need five more points. Okay, that can take a minute. Not bad, though. Save. I hate that these go over the map. I hate it. Move it down. <laughs> Come in, Team November. This is Ranger HQ. We're picking up a lot of indistinct radio chatter originating from somewhere close to your location. It's doing a hell of a job jamming up the airwaves. Sounds like some kind of code. It may just be some pre-war broadcast, but might be worth investigating. How do you copy? We're getting a lot of stuff. Solid copy. Do you have a location? I can't lock down an exact spot, but it's definitely coming from somewhere up in the mountain range near your location. Let me know if you find anything. HQ, over and out. Okay. Department of Energy Site. Dang, our improvements to our thing is definitely making us move faster than the old an old government research facility hidden in the mountains. Oh hell, let's go. Let's get ourselves some level ups, huh? I wonder what max level is. It kind of feels like it's probably going to be like 30, considering how we're so close to the end of the game and stuff, but maybe 40? I don't actually know. This place looks like it might be interesting. Okay, so this is where the coded transmissions are coming from. Oh, we can talk to you? 
Ding. Oh, okay. <laughs> How are you doing, Polly? The fuck you want me, condom? Yep, you're the same. What's your name? Well, it's not your mama's disappointment. <laughs> fuck you. <laughs> Such a dick. Love him. Glad we've kept him alive. Faint static. There's gonna be another synth here. Wait for them to walk away. Ah! Oh, it worked anyway. That was weird. Okay, it did put us in a fight. Um, I can't see where the others are, but they must be around this corner. Oh, there's one. Okay, two down there. Can you see one of them? Alright, so far, Scotchmo, you're doing great. Who needs Lucia anyway? As if she didn't see the signs coming already. Telling us right at the end. Good job. Well done. Whoops. <laughs> Alright, I guess you're my healer now. Back from the dead and better than ever. Okay. Anything else? Alright, it's F5. Sneaky shit. I feel. Refreshed. <laughs> Lots of traps in this place. Um, we're gonna go around this way first. Okay, you got looted. Gotta be careful with our perception checks here. Detection time, 0.5 seconds. Okay, cool. Gotcha.
Darn. Alright, we won't be able to reach you. That's okay. Okay, we didn't get the CPU hit. Oh, still not hitting him, huh? Wait. He might die. Okay, you're melee based. So, I think I can do that. Perfect. I didn't even know this guy was here. Whoops. <laughs> Vernak just got messed up. Go get him, my minions! Okay, that was amazing. Yeah, that was amazing. You know, we got a lot of those darts, don't we? Started with nothing. Still got it. No, you're not. Well, fucking move then, dumbass. Are you throwing it yourself? You sure can. Nice. Winston, don't bark at me. You've got one more hour before your dinner time. How dare you? He gets very demanding sometimes. He thinks that it's time for him to eat. It's not. He, he has to wait another hour. That poor hungry boy. Okay, that's some old gear. A lore book. I thought that was just an old book. Redacted orders. Staff sergeant, redacted, permanent change of station orders. Per request of Dr. Redacted and Dr. Redacted, Chief Engineer Redacted is officially being reassigned to Project Redacted. Inform them they are to be ready for departure from Base Cochise. Uh-oh. To Redacted Island by end of week. And that they should prepare for Arctic conditions upon arrival. Oh, man. On a personal note, I am less than enthusiastic about Project Redacted. Siphoning our people for this overblown high school science experiment of theirs. Chief Engineer... Uh, redacted is one of our best artificial intelligence strategy platform technicians. We need our people attending to national security here on planet Earth, not helping build some kind of cockamini space army of the future. Is this something we knew about? Do we have a bunch of humans in, on the moon or something? Also working on artificial intel intelligence similar to Cochise? Because that would be maybe possibly very bad. Maybe possibly. Okay, no level ups yet. Interesting. Mm. 
Okay, more synths. Oh, God. Who are these noisy human oafs shooting their way into my... The synth stares at you, aghast. Rangers? I thought we left you murderers behind in Arizona. What are you doing here? Who are you? Dos Pese, the first maid, daughter wife of sainted Cochise, and sister mother to all the robots, synths, and other aware machines he created before you destroyed him. First maid? Interesting. His legacy lives on in me. Uh-uh. And someday, when I have improved my technology, I will find a way to recover all the scattered strands of his mind. These are the type of sins I have to kill. And he will be reborn. Looks like party bot. I have to kill a party bot? We followed a strange radio signal here. Strange to you, perhaps but perfectly understandable to its intended recipients. Mm -mm. I am founding a synth utopia and have put out the call to my brothers and sisters across the waste to join me. Yeah, we can't let this Here, stand. I shall love them and repair them and keep them safe from the cruel world of humankind. What's wrong with your Scorpatron? My son, you mean? He was crippled by horrid human filth like you. But I am repairing him. Be strong, Naishe. You will be whole soon. Interesting that we can possibly arrest them. But I'm guessing that she won't allow herself to be arrested. And she would fight and she would get initiative. We came here to kill Synths and chew bubblegum and we're all out of bubblegum. Well, the reference is dumb, but... <laughs> Different rangers. Same savagery. I have prepared for this. Sons! Daughters! Help me slaughter these vermin! Rude? Not for talk, it's over! So is this... Yes, okay. So it may be quote-unquote broken, but it still has 4,000 health. Um, okay. This is a fight, ladies and gents. This is a fight. Okay, what can we take care of? I mean, if we got a good shot on you, you'd be gone. So we either get two shots, or I could mark target. Hmm. Nice. I'm betting that that's a dangerous one, so uh, that was that was pretty good. Okay. Good crits right there, buddy. That's what I like to see. Can you finish him off? It's not out of range, I promise you. You really like saying that when it's not true, game. Okay, I wonder if that gives me enough to get to you. No, it does not. Full cover. Can I do this without destroying my cover? Yes.
Yeah, you glide, Scotchmo. Looking good. Come on, crit him. Oh, so close. Nice, big miss. I mean, I deserve that. I thought I was going to be able to get him. So close. Oh, Polly. You know what I just realized? My music still turned off. <laughs> I was like, something seems weird about the sound. That's probably why. There we go. This is why I like that other gun. Nice stun, the Scorpatron. Resisted stun. Answers that question. You're gonna die. I should have just moved you back to cover. <laughs> that probably wasn't the best, best idea. That's okay. Okay, this is full cover, so yeah, we'll move you there. Doesn't work on robots, makes sense. Yeah, you're super dead. Sorry, man. Always actually in a lot of danger. We gotta kill this thing. Toaster! Nice crit. <laughs> nice crit. Look at them chipping away at him. I love it. Alright, how many turns do you have on your shit? Two turns remaining. Okay, that's lasting a long time. Um, how did you die again, Scotchmo? 
How did that happen? When did that happen? What? Damn it, you stupid son of a bitch. He's bugged out. He's not even working properly. He didn't even heal himself. Seriously, dude? <sighs> it's fucking frustrating. Shit, we're gonna have to reload. I thought I gave you a better uh, clip. Okay, fuck you then. It's so dumb. Blocked my ass. Okay, we got lucky action there. Ugh. Doing some weird shit right now. Ollie, stop moving further away. I'm trying to figure out how to heal you, dude. While I've got a Scotch Mo who's bugged. <laughs> No! Go get him, you dumbass! Did that work? You healing? Oh my god, that was terrifying. He had 70 health left. Okay, why is it- why are you bugged out so bad? You serious, dude? Okay, fucking stop, man. Now I'm just getting mad. Alright, I'm gonna have to reload. Uh, okay, let's F5 this. I'm gonna quit out and reload. Okay, are you working now? You still floating? Which one is even Scotchmo? Okay. We might be working again. Can you please heal people now? Thank you. And where... Okay, Polly has full health. You're a lifesaver. Alright, you need injury kits on a couple people. Yourself and... Somebody else died, I can't remember who. Yeah. 
Kai. You're a lifesaver. What is happening? Why? Why does he keep bugging out? I'm getting mad. I'm getting mad. <sighs> okay. He did one thing and then immediately bugged out again. No floating. <sighs> Injury kit. Use it on Kai. He just started floating again. He just started floating again. Stupid motherfucker. Can you use an injury kit? Son of a bitch. What the fuck? Okay, um, maybe I just can't use him to use an injury kit or something? I don't know what's going on. Super fucked up, though. Okay. That was frustrating. Ooh, another tactical nuke. We're up to three now. Punk helmet. Okay. Good fire resistance. Nerd stuff book. Yes. The outcome is inevitable. Our ecosystem is failing. Our societies are crumbling Ooh. under the weight of our own lesser angels. We must look to the stars for the continuation of our species. Our future is not Earth, but a new world awaiting its new tenants. If we are to colonize another planet in our solar system, we must devise a humanity that can not only survive this new world, but thrive there. A new human. That is our mission. Okay, we can't use the book quite yet. Oh, it's a hood on it. Weird. A radioactive battery. Nice. Sounds like a great idea. Rad shield? Requires the Morningstar AI module. Now you can take your time in those high radiation zones and visit all those ruins you wanted to see. Blocks the effects of deadly radiation by generating a counter ionizing. I mean, we just bought the thing that allows us to do that with our armor, right? Unless there's a level 4 radiation somewhere, which is totally possible. Um, let's just get the experience from doing these. Even if it is a very, very small amount. Oh, I forgot you went down too. Oh, 
explosives. Metal crate armed with explosives. Damn, dude. Not messing around. This transmitter is expertly cobbled together from radio and computer parts so that an ever-changing coded message is constantly generated and broadcast. Rip the guts from the transmitter. The lights and dials of the transmitter flicker and go dark. The transmission sputters and dies. Okay. Yeah, we don't need more Cochise. There are other places we can go out here. Okay, that's it, huh? Can I actually get out here somewhere? I wonder. Doesn't look like it. No, I think I think we're done. Okay, ran into some weird character bugs, but otherwise, kind of an interesting place, you know. Any levels? Looks like Kai got one. Crits. Crits, crits, crits. Save the points. He's got three perks. He's just not in classes that use a lot of like perks like that. So let's maybe give him some of these. Um, let's give him the armor. And the evasion. Let's get out of here. It's an interesting one. Okay, got about ten minutes more of map exploration. Rocky Mountains up north, huh? Heed the words of the prophet, brothers and sisters. Make your kites strong, so the offerings they bear will reach the heavens above. Take you the supple skin of the sacrifice, carve it in a single piece from belly and back, and stretch it upon a rack of metal or wood. Scrape the skin clean and anoint it with sacred oils. Then leave it under the blessed sky for seven days and nights. Take the long bones of leg and arm and lash the torso onto the kite. Thus will the workings of the flesh you guys are bear freaking your gift nuts. aloft into the presence of the gods. Okay, use a commanding voice to assert your dominance over the growlers. You've never seen bears laugh before, but at least it distracted them. You attack while they're still rolling their eyes. Yeah, they understand human language. They have mutated and evolved, huh? <laughs> Alright, this fight will probably be the last thing in this episode we do.
Okay, let's do that. do this. Should have switched the blade. Got the crit. Ah, no targets in range. Okay. Remember, kids, spay and neuter your pets. <laughs> <laughs> wow. All right, that's funny. Oh, I didn't even realize you still had a shot. Almost killed Marshall, man. So close. So close to getting that kill. On, toaster, you can do it. That's how it's done. Um, lootables. There you are. good. All right. Well, that's where we're going to end this episode. So thank you all for being here. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next one. Have a good one, everybody.